Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to do something on the street triple. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these, um, I've got some um, decals that go on the wheels. Um, I opted for a white color. Um, they come in lots of colors. You can get them to match your bike. They got all different kinds. And I'll talk more about that in a minute. Stay tuned. We're going to see how this <laughs> to having um, the um, the white speed triple it also came with um, came with several of those four of those and four a um, little bit smaller version for the front wheel uh, I assume for the front wheel so um, which looks like it's gonna work out but it also came with um, some small stickers that go around the uh, wheel um, these might have been for an older model that I didn't pay attention to in the description because they're a little bit the diameter isn't perfect although you can make it work without any problems. It's not too bad. And then there's also a red. And you can see I, I actually played with two of them um, and put that on there before we went on camera. But I, um, I'm i not going to use these because there's already a red red rim, a wheel, uh, you know, circle around the wheel. And it's just, it's too much. It's too busy. So I'm going to stick with just the, for now, stick with just the uh, white wheel um, letters. And uh, stay tuned. We're going to see how that goes. Okay guys, so the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna have to clean the wheel. And I've already cleaned the wheel with alcohol with a rag, but now I've got some paper towels, um, some little miniature paper towels. And I'm gonna go ahead and hit this again to make sure there's no crap on the wheel. Um, you just, you just wanna make it as clean as possible. Okay. And um, I think on this one side of the wheel, because of where I'm putting it, um, I'm, only go I'm not gonna do the other side because there's weights on the other side. And um, I've already put the other stickers on, uh, on the other side of this wheel. So there are already some stickers on there. And now that I figured it out how to do it properly, um, even though I had no problems. Actually, I already filmed this once and did um, something happened. I didn't, wasn't recording or something awesome. So it's always a sign of a good YouTuber when you forget to record, but it happens to us all. So if, what we're going to do is we're going to take this, this, um, we're going to take this. And you just want to press down. You want to press down nice and tight. Also, make sure you ain't got no cuts in your fingers. We're gonna, we're just gonna get our fingers uh, wet with some alcohol. Make sure your hands are clean. You just want to, you just want to press down on this um, sticker to make sure it sticks on the backing. Because there's a backing that we're gonna, we're gonna peel um, the backing off, and the front layer is, um, is um, clear, and the white letters are gonna stick to it. Once we apply it, we're gonna peel the clear layer off so but you want these you want these to stick to the front piece so just go ahead push down on them make sure everything's nice and tight and just grab an edge and just slowly peel off and if the letter starts coming with it push it back on and kind of peel it a little bit till it sticks in place and don't just rip it off because then you're gonna lose it see like the letter I'm losing a letter so we're just gonna push on there a little bit and the letter sticks so it's easy it's definitely not rocket science um and then what we're going to do is we're going to take this and because of the uh because the rim has like a bevel to it i'm going to try to put it right down here and we're going to we're going to lay the the uh, bottom layer down and then we're going to fold it up around this little little lip there so then we're just going to try to keep your fingers off the off the letters themselves so grab it like there, I'm grab. I'm touching places that aren't don't have letters, and I'm going to just kind of press this. I'm just gonna lay it down and not press down. Shit. All right. So, just going to lay it down, trying to get um, my hand off of it. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna start with one side, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're going to um. I didn't get my elbow out. We're going to try to lay it down and keep keep the um, distance proper. And we're going to put our finger right in the middle. And we're just going to push on the bottom level. We haven't gone up on the step there. Okay, not yet. So, so there you go. We're going to do that. And I'm going to push over to the other side. And there you go. Just one finger deal. We're going to we're going to press down nice and tight. Really press it down. And I'm going to slowly work my finger up over that little lip until I squeeze the air out. Now just pay attention to the um, to the decal 
the sticker or whatever you want to call it and make sure you're not trapping air so don't just blanket it with your hand you know just work work the letters up work the air out um, and it comes off it's it comes out pretty good um, so now I'm just gonna now we're just gonna press down we're gonna work our finger over the whole letter over the whole letters like this let me get you a little bit closer okay we're just gonna push our fingers over the whole letter here make sure we're rolling all the possible ripples out make sure it's nice and tight really want this thing to stick well because it's going to be moving pretty fast um, okay now now that's done we're going to go ahead up here and we're going to grab the clear layer and you just want to use one finger kind of or maybe two fingers and you want to kind of peel this clear layer off and nice and slow and try to keep it don't pull it don't lift it 90 degrees and try to pop 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 it off like that just you just want to grab a hold of it push it back down to the wheel and just bring it off as even to the wheel as you can like that go slow if anything starts to move just take care of it on the spot And there you go, that's it. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go over. We're just going to go over every letter. It's always best to do this on a halfway warm day. It is close to 70-something um, degrees here, seven, mid-70s at least, if not 80 degrees in the sun right now in Florida. So, so there you go. Um... This, it has a little bit of, you can see where this kind of rises up, rises up, but it, it looks okay when it's on there. Um, I'm just going to, there we go. Now, I mentioned I already had the other side done, so we're going to roll this around. There you go. Um, good to go. I actually put that one up a little higher, but it ain't hurt nothing. You can't tell. Um... So there we go. Now what we're going to do is we are going to take it for a ride. We're going to take it for a ride. I'm going to show you what it looks like when it's rolling. I'm going to show you what it looks like after I move the bike out in the sun, let them all bake on there and stay tuned. And we're going to find out here in a minute. Okay guys, so here we go. That's what she looks like. I wound up taking off the, uh, the one I had that was in red because I thought it was just too busy. And um, but I, I wanted to try them because I bought the damn things. So there you go. There's looking around. Street triple. Um, you can see them. There it is on the front. On the front top and bottom. On the front. So I think it looks pretty good. Um, yeah, I've got the um, belly pan off to the moment. Um, but uh, I think they came out looking pretty good. I like them. Okay guys, so we're out on the road and um, we're testing to see how these wheels look while they're turning. I got this fancy new visor, uh, keep the sun out of my eyes. Um, I can just barely see the front tire if I look out and uh, uncomfortably hang off the bike um, going straight and upright. Um, but I can see it. And uh, from what I can see, it looks pretty cool. We'll see what the other angles look like.
So as you can see on the front wheel, uh, the front wheel, you know, you can see just a, you can kind of tell that there's letters there. Obviously, you can't read them because it's moving so fast. But it's kind of neat. Gives a little stripe, kind of like a, uh, you know, a race car or something. With the writing on the uh, wheels or the tires. The back wheel, you can see it's doing the same as the front, where it is, um, it, it is uh, giving you that little stripe of white. Uh, going fast enough, it turns into one solid, but. Uh, it takes a lot to actually get there. Um, at 60, I think it's, uh, which is about where I was going, 60, 65, uh, you can see that it's, um, that it's, you know, kind of uh, just a, you sort of see it, there's letters there, but I think it looks pretty neat. I think the bike sitting still looks pretty cool. Um, it's pretty neat. Uh, and it, it just lets someone know when they walk up on the bike what it, exactly what it is. And you can see it much better than the graphics on the bike. I, I am kind of looking for, I want to do the belly pan, which I have off right now, but I want to do the belly pan within a Union Jack belly pan cover. Um, I'm trying to find that. And all the uh, all the uh, sellers on eBay only have it for 2019, which is a different shape belly pan for some reason. So uh, I was actually in contact with that guy, and he actually just told me that he ordered a uh, 2020, <clears throat> excuse me, in a belly pan so i'm excited hopefully soon he'll have a uh, decal for that so i am here at um i'm here at the bait shop and i'm going to get some um crickets for my wife's lizards um she uh has a uh, a youtube channel on that so please check it out it's leaping lizards i'll leave a link to it below um providing i remember uh but i'll try um leaping lizards um she just had two baby lizards born um i guess overnight um two eggs um, the hatched cutest little things are about an inch and a half long um, check it out I'm sure she'll be having a video there soon and you can see the last the last couple she had uh, born and um, yeah check her channel out thanks for checking me out guys as always uh, I really appreciate it and um, it's it's always a blast to um, to be able to come to you guys and show you different things please check out both channels evolving mail and also check out um, E, um, squid moto by evolving mail uh, depending on which one you're watch which channel you're watching this and maybe on that one please subscribe to both uh, please check me out on Facebook um, uh, Instagram YouTube and um, TikTok so I appreciate it guys as always peace out